Yeah, I kind of did a bad thing again. Uh, how do I explain this? I bought another mystery box, or this isn't a bag, so I bought another mystery bag. Now this lovely bag was given to me by the Football House. Now it was purchased by me, unlike the other video, which was sort of half and half. This one was basically, uh, yeah, a good old bag worth of kits that I'm looking forward to opening, but well, I know it's pretty cautious time, so I definitely will have to use a bit of hand sanitizer. And um, let's get straight into it. And I just wanna say a quick thank you to the Football House for providing this amazing package for me for, yeah, for making more content for everyone to watch. Now, this channel was created during lockdown number one. It is now currently lockdown 2.0. I do have a lot more plans. Uh, yeah, look, I uh, just wanna say another massive thank you to everyone out there that watches my videos. I am getting more comfortable speaking in front of a camera and a, a random light, but uh, thank you. That's all I wanna say is just thank you so much for, yeah, believing in this channel. So how do we wanna do this? So we're gonna go straight into it, just rip it up. Now I know I haven't seen anything. I don't know what's inside this. I just said to the football house, I'm like, look, here's some money. Let me know how many kits you can get. And I think we said about 13. I am either gonna sell these myself and make my profit back. Uh, and uh, yeah, look, if someone wants any of these kits, hit me below and I'll uh, try and work it out for you. All right, I had a bit of a sneak peek. I don't want to know what's in it. I wanna be surprised with you guys. So let's get this started. Now a video I really wanna you know, create in the future is how brands or companies, you know, deal with their product, you know, for example, when you buy Nike, you get in a beautiful Nike bag, Adidas, and then you look at all the sort of kit stores, you know, classic, they give you a nice little card saying thank you for shopping. It's nice to see a little bit of packaging, so that's really nice of you, mate. Thank you so much for that. Now, we've got two bags. It's being separated into two lots of kits. Uh, I can see what's on here, so I'm gonna put this one aside, and we'll start into this one. Now, Tim, Tim's the guy who runs the football house. He's based in Tasmania and I have to say, uh, thank you so much again for this one. This is uh, really exciting. Uh, how do you open this packaging? You've got some really heavy duty plastic on these. Oh my God, I actually can't open it. I've seen almost every kit now because I can't open this. Probably should have got scissors. Be right back. All right, all right. Nice. That was much easier than expected. All right, kit number one. What do we have here? Oh, I see a Japanese flag. I need this knife again. What the hell? All right, so num kit number one. Oh my God. This, this is beautiful. What? Oh man, this is a really nice kit. I actually really wanted a Japanese kit. If you're watching this video, I posted the current Adidas kit that Japan has um, with Tosuki, a local um, footballer in Australia. But wow, this is actually awesome. I've always wanted a Japanese kit. Good start. One down, two. Oh man. Oh, what? A Wolfsburg kit, but like, this is a really good color. Yeah, perfect. Another Nike kit that I love and one for the collection. So far, so good. Oh man, I can't stand Spurs, but good memories with this one. When they were down in Australia, I actually had the opportunity to work with AIA, the sponsor. They flew me and all the agency that I was working with to Sydney to basically shoot some of their events up at, um, pretty sure they went to the bridge, the opera house, etc. But um, yeah, good memories of this one. So if you're a Spurs fan, definitely we'll be selling this one to you because it is a great, great kit in a sense how simple it was, but um, good memories for me with that one. All right. Well, second bag now. Yes, another classic and a beautiful size as well for me. Lovely kit. Oh, this is a random one. Cameroon. Where'd you find this one? 
All right, next one. Oh man, training top. I love a good dark kit and even a training top, but this is great. What year was this? I'm pretty sure it would be last year, 2019, 2018. But yes, I do love a good training top. So this is, yeah, great one to have in my collection. So like I said, this is a bit of a short video. Um, I don't like to make too many of these because I'm gonna go broke. I do look forward to making more of these videos, but I do want to make sure I don't need to spend too much on these videos. All right, 10 years later, finally opened the bag. We have the honeycomb. Oh, it's got a Pogba on the back. But yeah, this was a nice old uh, Newton Heath sort of connection kit with the honeycomb. The bee almost representing, I think represents Manchester as the working bee. So the honeycomb design down the middle was a perfect one uh, to connect to that. I think also this is the Zlatan era. Correct me if I'm wrong. Oh man, I just bought the latest Dortmund kit. I'm gonna do an episode on that, but uh, this is the current season, or the season that it was. Love this one. All right, what do we have next, what do we have next? Don't want to cut the kit, but I have to make sure I don't stab my finger. And... Uh, it's blue. Oh, no. Are you kidding me? A number 10 Nakamura kit. Now I've got two Japanese jerseys. I, I kind of wish I had this when I went to Japan last year. Have a look at that. Yeah, this, this is literally why I do these videos because I know to some they may be just random kits but they have a Nakamura Japan kit oh man just look at that simple or simplicity at its best all right so if you're from Turkey this one definitely will be yours what do you think do you reckon Ozil will maybe side with the Turkish team in the future now that he has cut all ties with Germany. I know a lot of players out there like Diogo um, has went from Brazil to Spain or vice versa, I can't remember. Um, do you reckon Ozil will go to, to the Turkish team in the future? This one will definitely be on sale if you guys want it. All right, two more kits. <laughs> no way. Uh, so I I do I do tie my ways with Portland Timbers, but uh, MLS is one of those leagues where I do solely enjoy watching the football. I spent all day yesterday and today just watching teams like Inter Miami, Portland Timbers play against I think LA Galaxy. It's just yeah, it's just one of those leagues you just love because the Americans put a lot of effort into their marketing when it comes to sport. So yeah, New York City kit. But yeah, thanks for that. Oh man, this is a classic and it's a dark kit as well. But a Barca, Qatar, I think this was when Chess Fabricas was there, so maybe 2016? Was this a game day kit or training kit? Either way, it's a black kit, so this would be perfect for the gym. Wow, that was a great, great uh, handful of kits. So thank you so much team at the Football House for this uh, care package for me. Um, if you're interested in any of these kits that I will uh, not add to my session. I think there's only two or three of the kits here that I definitely will probably not wear just because of, you know, personal choices. But um, if you're interested, uh, message me below or I may upload them to my Depop. But thank you so much to the Football House. Again, I will put all the details. I don't know if you can see that card, but that, yeah, all the details in the description below. But yeah, thank you so much for watching this video. Um, I do look forward to creating more awesome videos rather than this short, quick one. Keep an eye on my channel as I do hope to at least do two videos a week or if not 
one video per week. Um, again, thank you so much for watching all my videos and if you can, please subscribe below and I'll see you guys in the future. For now, goodbye.